Hello friends, it's Sherry from Turquoise Dreaming. How you doing today? Hope you're doing well. Welcome to my channel. I am here to share some happy mail. So, uh, yeah, I got happy mail. I'm super excited to see what it is because it's from my friend Louisa. From She lives in New Zealand. I have never received anything in my whole life from New Zealand. So it's so cool to receive something from another country. From a friend, first of all, and from another country. That, um, you know, could have some really unique stuff that you've never seen, right? So let's see what uh, Louisa sent me. Um, I became friends with Louisa because first I think she was a subby on my channel. And then she uh, won something actually twice from me. So <laughs> super cool. That was neat that we became friends. And then she won, you know, a second thing from me after the first thing. And I got to mail something to New Zealand. So, let's see what Louisa sent me. Uh, this is so fun. I just cannot wait to see what it is. <laughs> so, here's like, I took everything out of the original envelope. I don't want to, I, I I know I kind of have a tendency to uh, just turn things around and, <laughs> and get carried away and end up showing the address. So, kind of just kind of remove that temptation from the pile here. So, uh, yeah, here's a little postal label. Oh, this is a note. Okay, let's see what it says. She added some pieces that are uniquely New Zealand. Cool. Okay, so she explains here what she has sent me. Okay, I may have to refer back to that um, during or after. So let's see. I'm going to look in here first. It says Kiwi Bank on this envelope, so that's cool. Apparently a bank in uh, New Zealand. Awesome. <laughs> so she sent me, it does say something about bank stuff in her note. So let's see, Kiwi Bank. Cool. <laughs> you know we don't have any Kiwi Banks here, right? <laughs> so, little envelope that says Kiwi Bank. Oh, here's her card. Okay. Cool. That's awesome. Some little stickers. Aren't those cute? Awesome. 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 <laughs> so cute. Okay, so here's like withdrawal slips and deposit slips from uh, Kiwi Bank. I just want to see what they look like. The difference between maybe something there, a bank there, and a bank here. <clears throat> Very cool. And okay, let me see. Sending prezzies this Christmas. <laughs> prezzies, that sounds like a word I haven't heard before. Uh, a New Zealand or something, you know, a word that we don't use in the U.S., prezzies. So that's neat to see. New Zealand Post.co, so a website, a New, New Zealand website. Let's try to see if there's anything else. Uh, New Zealand -y here, New Zealand Post. So cool, right? Let's see if there's anything that jumps out at me here. New Zealandy, very neat. Awesome. Okay. Thank you, Louisa. That was cool to see, right? The differences. That's awesome. Thank you. Okay, here's a package. Merry Christmas. Yes, you can open now. <laughs> well, let me open that last. I think. I don't know what it is, but I think it might. I might want to open it last. I don't know. I get that vibe. So uh, this is a very heavy ba bag right here. So I don't know what's in here. Write, draw, pick, prod, and sail away with paper plus. Oh, cool! Things to write, draw. Okay, so maybe a store. Sounds like my kind of store from New Zealand. That's neat. This paper bag. Very cool. Okay, this is where I work. Oh, sh you work at Paper Plus? Really? Wow, that sounds like a cool place to uh, work. <laughs> awesome. I didn't know. Okay, let's see what we have here. We have, okay, she wrapped it in this plastic, first of all. Whatever's here, she wrapped it in this cool plastic. Not sure what it is, but it looks pretty neat. Uh, something like a reminds me of like a book cover 
let's see, we've got different little fairies here. Uh, okay, yeah, it, 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 it's, it's reminding me of a book cover, and it is some kind of a book cover. Okay, I said that before I even knew what it was, but there's flaps on either side. Like you tuck a book in here. Not sure what it's from, but that is really neat. So there's fairies on here with there, like there's a butterfly here, and uh, you know, all the fairies have wings and they're really pretty. Ladybug, here's a um, column right here of of butterflies and there's different butterflies on here. Isn't that interesting? Okay, yeah, I'm getting ideas as I'm looking at this. <laughs> Possible journal cover or, you know, could you could actually cut out these little squares and use them too, so squares and rectangles here. So I think these are the same and there's three of those. Those are really pretty though. They're such pretty little um, fairies, fairy girls. They look like uh, they look like pictures of real girls with uh, made into fairies or dressed up like fairies with their wings and everything. Very pretty. Thank you, Louisa. That is very uni that's very unique right there. So okay, here's some paper that has some painting on it. Very misty looking and very pretty. I like that. Okay, something from from um, New Zealand. Okay, and here's some more bank items, it looks like. Some paint samples, neat. Different, uh, yeah, you can cut these up and make these into tags, and even the little squares you can do something with. These could be neat in layering or making little, like, postage stamps type things, you know. That would be a lot of fun to cut these out in... Uh, put some like make clusters or a little postage stamp type clusters and look at all the different colors these are very pretty colors too but I like this one this might be my favorite <laughs> all the turquoisey colors and then there's reds and burgundies some like tans grays greens and I like the greens too those are nice and bright and grays let's see is that the same as the other gray and different grays very neat. Thank you, Louisa. That's really different. Like, we don't have... I've never seen paint samples like this in the U.S., so very neat to have something different like that. Very cool. Thank you. Okay, some, some flyers. Neat. Neat, neat. Okay. Cool. Trying to see where it's from here. New Zealand government. New Zealand police. <laughs> Neat. Okay, this is a New Zealand post. So this is like a postcard. Two, and you put the address here. And then you can write maybe on the back just to let you know we're moving. Oh, okay. Cool. Isn't that neat? And that could be an awesome piece of ephemera or journaling card or whatever you want it to be so that is different and neat okay so let's see we've got oh what are these these look like fun there's a bunch of these in plastic Ooh, and some stickers okay what shall I open first let's see this is in a ziploc bag neat let's see what's in here Okay, we've got some more of the deposit slips, which these are great little journaling spots, right? A bunch of those. So they have like lines like this on the front, of course, with the different deposit information. And then there's lines on the back. Perfect little journaling spot. Yes, and there's a bunch of those. So those are something really di different and unique that, you know, from New Zealand. Okay, oh, look at this. What do we have here? Wow, this is cool. Two from, and it's a, it's, um, let's see. It's, it says New Zealand Post, so maybe it came from the post office. And a gift card. Your Prezi card has been 
loaded. So Prezi card, like a gift card. <laughs> but maybe that's a brand. Prezi? Not sure. It looks like it. Cool. So you can, I think you, you can, you're supposed to use this to maybe send it. I don't know if it's just to give it or to send it through the mail. It says to from. No. Yeah, just to give it, I think. Okay. Yep. So neat little journaling card can be used for that. Yeah, I like that because you could write something here. You could write it all here. You could put a picture right here. That would be cool. Instead of a gift card, put a picture right here. And it, and then you can cover the back if you wanted uh, with some coffee dye paper or some other kind of ledger paper or something, you know, that, that you would want to cover the back with. So neat. So there's a bunch of those. And those are really neat and they kind of Christmassy too with the red bow. And then these are really Christmassy because because this looks like a Christmas tree <laughs> in the background here. Oh, these are pretty. Thank you, Louisa. Wow. This is so neat. And this is red on the inside. Isn't that cool? Wow. And I wonder, I just, yeah, that's so neat. Something like our post office if they have anything like this, you'd have to pay for it. So I don't know if she had to pay for these or if they're free from the post office. But at our post office, they don't have anything free like this, exactly like this, uh, or at all like this. If you know, there's cards there, but they're you have to pay for them. So if these are free, that is really cool at um, the New Zealand post office. So very neat. That's awesome. <laughs> I would get a bunch of those if they had them in our post office, that's for sure. For free, anyway. Okay, so this is stickers, gift tags. These are really neat, two from. So these are, like this one is a bird with a Santa hat, so that one's Christmassy. Jingle all the way. Okay, so they're all Christmassy. And there is it's a 12 pack, so there's probably, I would think there's two of these. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, there's probably two of these the same. So that's really cool. I like this little retro camper here. It's very cute. <laughs> Ice cream cones, a cake, and some little season's greetings. But it's uh, on the water with a little tree on the... Here's the, this car with the surfboard, and this one has the tree on it. <laughs> Super cute. Yeah, I like that. Very neat, very neat. Thank you, those are awesome. So these are, let's see, let's see, let's see. Johnson Sands blank. So this is a blank card. I'm trying to see if it has an envelope in there or what kind of card it is, you know what I mean? Oh, I think it does. It has a card in an envelope. So that's neat, a card in an envelope. And we do have um, at the stores, uh, they know they have cards like that where you can get one card in an envelope uh, and a plastic sleeve like that. Um, so that is neat. And this is really pretty. I wonder if this is a flower in New Zealand. I, I bet it is. <laughs> Very pretty too. Look at that flower. That is neat. That's not a flower I've ever seen around here. That's for sure. That is pretty. I like the. It's like a burst of puff and then it has tiny little different colored specks on the on the ends of the fibers like that are coming up so very pretty very pretty so let's see so this is um, a card and an envelope and everyone so I'll just show you instead of taking everyone out what they look like so there's different this, this is probably this is a blank card it says blank right here and then there's uh, it has all these little pictures here which is neat and this is so this is like ocean related on this one and this one is other items I love New Zealand so these are probably I guess different scenes and things in, that you would see in New Zealand so that is really neat to see uh, I think I have seen New Zealand on uh, I used to watch HGTV a lot, uh, and I think I remember when they have the international HGTV shows, 
where people are buying property or a house or something in New Zealand or move, moving to New Zealand or different countries. Anyway, I remember one, at least one from New Zealand. And I just remember it being like, wow, that looks like a beautiful place, you know? And so, yeah, these pictures are, there's like uh, mountains and, uh, you know, you it has like here's a big city here. Uh, water by the mountain. Here's a cabin. Here's a big like uh, uh, looks like a sport. It almost looks like a sports arena. I don't know if it is. Here's countryside with uh, it looks like maybe sheep, but I'm not sure if that's what I'm seeing. And just other in really interesting. Here's a like a river, like a um, it looks like a calm river right here. And just here's a pretty sunset. It's really pretty. It looks like a really pretty country. So, uh, here's, okay, here's different. I love New Zealand. So here's fruits and different foods in New Zealand, apparently. <laughs> That's cool. Kiwi must be big there. And just other type of foods. Here's, it looks like uh, cherries and other things. So very neat. And then this is another picture. Oh, this is neat. Very pretty. If that's New Zealand, that's very pretty. I always like to see. And look at this colorful. Uh, there, the sails are down on the sailboat, but they're turquoise colored, so very pretty. Very uh, architectural buildings here, like this one in the background here. And the colorful restaurants here on the water side. So very, very neat. Okay, so one more package here, the one that says Merry Christmas. Again, she didn't have to send me anything. She was just like, I had sent her two packages and she just said, I want to send you something. And I was like, that is so cool because, you know, first of all, she's become my friend. And second of all, it's from New Zealand. <laughs> so let's see. Oh, a handmade card. Fabulous friend, isn't that? Look at this, it's embossed. There's like three, one, two, three layers here. That's neat. And then uh, the embossed and then the flower and then the card. So very neat. <laughs> cool, awesome, thank you Louise. So that is a beautiful card. I like the glittery heart too. Very pretty and that's the envelope. Yes, I can open it now, so let's go for it. <laughs> Red tissue paper for Christmas. Okay. Oh, awesome. She made something here for me. Cute. Okay, so she says, made for Sherry from Louisa 2019. And she's got some the teeniest, teeniest, tiniest little glitter scar stars there. Aren't those cute on a tiny little tag? <laughs> so cute. Hope you can see that. Let me show you one more time. Isn't that cute? <laughs> I love little tiny tags. I make those too, and uh, they are they're adorable. So this set, this is um, it says New Zealand right here, and a word up here I'm not going to try to pronounce, but I'll show it to you. This looks like a postage stamp. Oh, that's neat. Here's the back, another postage stamp. It says 40 cents, and it's the mountains and the water. And this one says 40 cents, too. And it's a nice big stamp. Both of these are nice big stamps. So she's made a little journal here. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Look at these little stars. Are those stickers? They're so tiny. I love those. Aren't they cute? So she's got different stamps in here. Oh, I love postage stamps for one thing. I don't know if you knew that, Louisa, but I love postage stamps. And so this is a stamp. It looks like a stamp on each page from New Zealand. <clears throat> and here's some little tiny heart stickers. Right here and here. Aren't they cute? So yes, postage stamps. Isn't that neat? And I, I, you know, I don't know if you, if you watch my channel, you know, I made a little book like this. So she's made a little book like, like, um, I did with the boxes with the little Christmas sticker boxes and very neat. I love the spine here and she's glued the, 
she's got a long kind of uh, string here on the tag, which is really pretty. She's got extra string down here on this side, and then a long string here that she looks like she's glued to the spine, which is a really neat kind of almost like a little dangly tag on the side of the spine. It's really cute like that. And then the postage stamps. I'm going to hold it a little bit close so you guys can see the stamps too. Let me let me just go quick from the beginning because I'm kind of I know I was probably holding it down quite a bit and I'm sure you can't see way down there so let me just take you through it real quick and get you to where I am this is where I am right here so this is uh, very pretty they say New, Le New Zealand on them here's a little cute little heart on a piece of little circle there die cut or something C cute and good idea I, for, I forget to use my little circles. I have a, my circle, my tiniest circle punch is not this small, but still I, I'm just saying I forget to use it, but that's a good use of it. Just, you know, the circle with something on it, like a, a little tiny top star sticker or some kind of little sticker. So very cute. Look at this one. I love these stickers. These are adorable. A little pair of glasses here. <laughs> They almost feel like metal. They're cute. So more postage stamps. Let me show you these. And look at this heart. This one's something like a made out of something di something different. And here's another two layered thing with a little teeny tiny circle, like maybe almost like a circle that you get from your hole punch, right here. And let me show you this. These two pages cute and a little shoe and a little heart some little hearts here on this one super cute thank you Louisa this is so adorable <laughs> so adorable here's a little flower with the heart over here and a little star over here and two pretty two pretty stamps so cool so cool Love this is a really good idea. A uh, little stamp push a stamp book. If you have a little stamp collection, this is what you could do with it, right? Make yourself a little journal. Or if you need a gift for someone that likes postage stamps, the perfect little stamp book here. So this here's another flower with a star and another little heart here. And this one has little specks, you know, dots like polka dots on it. And these are really pretty stamps too. One, this one has a neat little duck on it, and this one has a pretty, like a botanical scene there. Very pretty, and that's the end. So cute. That is just adorable. I love it. <laughs> that is adorable. Okay, now here she's got like one of the um, folders, like uh, don't, like a folio type thing. So here's the middle part that you could write on here if I wanted to, I guess. Very neat, and so it's a piece of paper. Almost looks like a page out of a magazine, maybe, or some kind of catalog. But it has, it says to-do list. Okay, so this is, she put this on here, to-do list, shopping list, and it's got a dot grid background. A little kind of, oh no, that's part of the paper. That's part of this, this right here. It looks like it was something on there, but it's part of this here. It's like uh, there's a watering can right there, so it looks like it's from a garden book or magazine or something. So and then this side, here it folds like this, so here you've got the folder part and two pockets here. So let's see what's in the pockets. We've got, ooh, this is pretty. Wow, purple. Okay, hold on. <laughs> this is a little envelope. Yes. Okay, so it goes like this. This is a really beautiful piece of paper, first of all. It looks like she made the envelope. And a beautiful purple flowery piece of paper with, uh, this is from, this is look. I, this is a used postage stamp, so it's got a postmark on it. But it's a purple one that matches the purple paper. So this is what it looks like, super pretty all together, right? And then you turn it over and it's got a little, 
double layer of pay, like cardstock and this little banner here that you could write something on and it holds the flap in so the flap folds up okay cool now I can see what's in there <laughs> so this might have been like a, a brochure it says something about tune into section D it could have been junk mail or you know from a magazine or something but anyway it's got writing on the inside so you can see maybe she got this pretty paper it was pretty on this side and then that almost looks like I'm going to say it looks like cotton I'm not sure what it really is but it looks like cotton for, to me from here <laughs> anyway uh, yeah cotton's grown in uh, in North Carolina too so that's why I'm saying it looks like cotton I've seen that before <laughs> so uh it might not be though, but it sure looks like it. Pretty little envelope and really cute and very I like how the flap goes all the way down here. That's neat. And look at the inside here with the little shape. Okay. Oh, I didn't even realize what I took out of here. Postage stamps. Awesome. So New Zealand stamps that I can use. Oh, yay. Thank you, Louisa. There's a purple one. Yay. <laughs> So cool. Awesome. Oh, what is this? I'm not going to try to figure out what they are, but it looks like a big bird. <laughs> it probably isn't, though. Okay. I'm going to try to hold them upright. This is a pretty one. They're all pretty. I love postage stamps. I don't know if I'm going to be able to use these, though. They're too pretty, and they're from New Zealand. I'll never get these again, right? <laughs> New Zealand. So cool. Oh, she put this one on something. On the uh, book, I think. Yep, yep. Here it is. Here it is, here it is. Here's the book, and here's she sent me one. So cool. <laughs> Thank you. And this is pretty. The mountain and the water. Oh, I'm dropping. Auckland, New Zealand. Auckland, huh? I used to know someone with that last name. New Zealand, that's a water in the mountain, and here's a... Sorry, I, I'll go quicker. I know I'm taking too long here, so... But they're really pretty stamps. Thank you. I just want to look at them all, though. <laughs> so I'll go quick so the video doesn't get too long, but very... Ooh, look at this one with the birds. Let me show you. Because I know stamps are tiny. There's no way you guys are going to see them in the camera. Is that some kind of a bug? <laughs> a New Zealand bug? Oh, this is a pretty one. Look at this one. It looks like a... It looks like a... Waters with the islands in them, possibly. Or... Uh, when I first saw it, I said map, but then it looks like actual land in, you know, in the water, like islands. Okay, and here's one of those pretty purple ones, and... Let's see, I'm trying to hold it the right way. I like the colors on that one. I can't tell quite what it is right now. But very cool. Wow, how'd you get all this in there? <laughs> look at the look at the envelope now. All that was in that envelope, in this envelope right here. Very cool. Thank you. Thank you, Louisa. And so those were in here in this pocket. And here's some like papery tags. Very pretty with lines. So those are great little journaling spots. I like I like those a lot. I like that kind of stuff. So, so cool. So on here she says, "I have to figure out how you folded this. That's really neat, and it looks nice. Keep together or separate and decorate into individual tags." Okay. Oh, I see. Yeah, I can uh, keep these together or separate, like cut them apart and decorate into individual tags. So she's got eyelash trim here and pictures of people, which I don't want to guess what they are, but I think maybe these are some, are these New Zealand people? Um, Louisa, you'll have to tell me exactly, because I don't know, but yeah, they come out. So uh, maybe some original, like, people that uh, are from New Zealand, like 
you know, uh, you'll have to explain it to me because I'm not going to try to explain. I don't want to say anything wrong or, you know, unpol unpolitically correct. <laughs> so, uh, no, or not poli politi politically correct. But, uh, yeah, those look like they might be original um, New Zealanders or something. So, very cool. Thank you. That's really neat. Like hi historical type people, right? Pictures, possibly. Anyway, very cool. I'm just kind of fascinated now by this. She's got some coffee dyeing going on here. And just very neat. So, thank you. Awesome. Okay, so that's it. I'll let y'all go. I don't want to keep you on this busy weekend before uh, some pretty plants here. Succulents. And so, yeah, that's from, definitely from some kind of a gardeny page there. Very neat. Oh, I didn't even look at this right here. Beautiful, it says. So it's kind of sticker on another pretty piece of paper. Very neat. So cool. I like that whole, this whole folder look too. So thank you so much, Louisa. That's, uh, that was so cool to re-see something from you and that you live in New Zealand. That's, um, just kind of, uh, so cool to me because, you know, uh, I haven't got a lot of mail from other countries. So, uh, very neat to get something from another country too. So thank you so much for sharing your country with me and, uh, us. And my YouTube, you know, all of our YouTube friends can see, you know, because a lot of my subbies know you, too. Uh, so, awesome, and thank you, and I'll let y'all go. Have a nice weekend. Happy crafting, and see you next time.